It was God ordained that I be in that place at that time. U.S. postal worker Keith Rollins says he was driving on I-95 North when he noticed something unusual on the side of the road right before Route 100. I didn't know whether it was human head or whether it was an animal. I pulled over, called 911, and it ended up being the little boy. And he was behind there shivering, cold. He only had a pair of sweatpants on and a sweatshirt, no shoes or socks. I walked up to him and said, hey buddy, how you doing? It was the two-year-old Howard County Police had been searching for since about 10 o'clock the night before. They said Ethan Adeyemi had wandered away from his home on the 7800 block of Blue Stream Drive in Elkridge and made it half a mile when Keith found him around 8 Thursday morning. I decided to just scoop him up and I took him to my, uh, my vehicle and turned up the heat. Keith said he hadn't responded. Police say the two-year-old is nonverbal. Officers took him to the hospital, where the child's family says he was treated for hypothermia. He's now home recovering. I mean, it could have been a totally different story if he had stepped out on uh, 95, trying to cross the road. Ethan's family told me they're grateful that did not happen. I was just glad to be a part of a good ending situation. But a hero, nah. Jess Arnold, WUSA 9.